Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to export the Unreal Engine 5.1 3D models material texture as the JPG or PNG images. And even sometimes you can't see any of the material inside any of the 3D models. How are you going to back out the materials and get the texture as JPG or PNG image? So start from now, I'm going to show you step by step. First, I'm going to open my Unreal Engine editor. And everything I'm going to start from a fresh new game project. As demo, I'm going to just create a fresh new game project, a third person game project like this. I create a third person, third person new game project. Now the Unreal Editor is loading a fresh new game project. Just wait for a while. And I'm going to show you some example, how to export the texture. Just for example, for this third person game project, if you try to play, you can see you have an avatar. This is the UE, UE5 Mana Queen. Right. The character is at here, the 3D model of the Mana Queen. It is under the meshes. Now, this is the one, the SKM Queen Simple. For example, this is, this is one of the 3D avatar one of the 3d model however you are unable to see any of the material here just for example if you open then what is this and where is the material this is the material instance and sometimes you can't get where is the location and where is where are all the texture materials if you want to get them actually just follow an easier step here go to the assets then click back out materials then from here this blend mode is opaque because the original is opaque then next you choose here the properties it is going to back out the diffuse but it is not only the diffuse you still have other like reflections like the OA and also the opacity map the normal map etc so you have to click add Add everything, for example, opacity, then opacity mass, metallic, specular, then plus again, the roughness, then, as long as you can see, you try to export it out everything from here, the tangent, subsurface, and also the ambient occlusions. And then the texture size, of course, you just make it as big as possible. Let's, let's say, for example, 2048. Here also, 2048. Then click Confirm. Now you can see the Unreal Engine 5 is baking the material from this 3D avatar. And it is going to export out and extract out all of the material texture inside the same folder of the skeleton mesh you just wait for a while now it is baking the material Right now you can see actually it's done and here you, you have to wait for a while also because it is preparing the shader it is relocated all of the material texture now under the meshes you back to the mannequin then enter the meshes again you should be able to see that all of the texture already back out now here also done already 
It is the same, but it, it is just back out of the materials. You can see the material is here. This is the material instance. And at the same time, you can see all of the textures. For example, this. To get all of these textures, sometimes after you export the skeletal mesh as FBX, it is not going to export out all of the texture together. So now it works. I click the first ones, hold the shift, click the last ones, and I can just export it out. I right click it, just right click, asset action, and export it out. And as demo, I'm going to export on my desktop. I create a new folder on my desktop. Then I name this as texture. Inside this folder, I click save. And it is going to pop out a few times how many textures, materials here. It is going to pop out the equivalence of the amount. See? It is exporting one by one. And now done, back to your folder. It is under the texture folder. You can see all of these material textures also included the, the normal map and also this, the specular. If you try to double click to open, what is the size? The size is 2048 because just now you key in 2048, it is going to big out and export as 2048. And now everything already here, all of the material texture already get exported out from Unreal Engine. And then if you try to export the, the FBX avatar, right click and export asset, asset actions and export inside the same folder, the FBX, you click save, export. It is going to export the FBX. If you double click it and have a check, and actually, it is not together with the texture. If you want to bring this avatar to the third-party software, like other 3D animation software, then you have to export out all of this material texture and then remap all of the material texture in the third-party software. Otherwise, it won't embed it inside the FBX. Right. That's all for today about my sharing on how to export the material texture from any of the 3D models in your Unreal Engine 5.1. Even if you can't see the material instance, you also can ex you also can back out and export it out as JPG and PNG images to get all of these textures. And that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my video tutorial, if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your 3D modeling, 3D animation, and game developing. You can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new video tutorial or sharing, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy! Happy 3D modeling, 3D animation, and game developing. See you!